Hello and welcome to the Humble Seer. So one of my subscribers um, has asked me to do a reading on uh, Tiffany Haddish and Aries Spears. And evidently there's uh, <clears throat> there's rumors of of child molestation. I didn't I I I had no idea that what was happening until my subscriber sent this to me and then I just took a peek and um, I, I'm just hearing this is not good and there's truth to this so yeah and it's not good <laughs> that's yeah I, I, I'm actually seeing some prison time for people <clears throat> involved in this. I mean, all right, but let's let's pull some cards, and um, I'm just seeing that Aries Spears, like he's flashing in front of me for some reason. Okay, so, but she's involved in this. I'm I'm getting <clears throat> okay, so. Let's let's see how do I want to do this? Um let's pull a card on the situation and we'll pull a card on the outcome. Let's see what happens there. Okay, so situation and outcome. All right. <clears throat> so the situation is the queen of wands. <clears throat> So the Queen of Wands, the card is about ambition, leadership, quality, bossiness. Hmm. So, wow, this is this is going to be this is going to be a tough read. Um, and I see that as representative of Tiffany in this situation that she is the leader in all of this um yeah let's see what is the outcome going to be i'll i'll talk a little more about this i'll get okay the outcome is the outcome is the chariot now the chariot is about drive victory winning the war revenge okay now there is an element of revenge in this okay now what i'm getting and hearing is some things may be blown out of proportion but there's still solid truth to much of what is being said There is still still solid truth in much of what be, is being said. There's still solid truth in much of what is being said. Let's clarify this. Okay, so so can we get another card on the outcome? Let's start there. What what else can you tell us about the outcome? of this and I'm and I'm just seeing that that guy that Aries Spears is I'm hearing just thrown to the wolves okay but not necessarily out of the two the most guilty all right so we have the seven of wands clarifying the chariot okay now the seven of wands is defiance De self-defense negotiation okay now the word negotiation as it relates to tiffany haddish really stands out um because you know she has the most to lose but i'm hearing that these allegations and what she's coming up against she'll never be it, it, uh, she'll never be the same it doesn't matter if it's true or not which i've said already that there's truth to this but it doesn't matter if it comes out and it's like oh you know we were kidding which it won't but i'm just saying just hypothetically if it were to come out that were to 
just like with Ricky Martin, you know, he was accused, although those allegations aren't true, uh, his career will never be the same. And I'm hearing that this is something of her own doing. It has nothing to do with the anybody, the industry wanting to get rid of her because she was their golden child is what I'm hearing. But this is her. She's on this tightrope, right? This depicts her. This is Tiffany Haddish. And she's on the tightrope and the people are jabbing at her because the people don't like it. And look at her expression. She has just been completely deflated. You know, like when you hear bad news, when you get bad news and I mean, just the worst news that you can ever imagine and your heart just sinks and you're just like all the blood rushes out of your face. That's how she's going to be feeling for months and months, okay? because she's on that tightrope. And that seven of wands is about defying, is about defending and standing your ground, trying to remain on top. It says remaining on top, but in this instance, it's trying to remain on top, but that's gone. You don't recover from something like this. So she's really, it, it is really about her. This reading is about her because we wanted to know what the outcome is. And the outcome right now is what, what I'm being told and seeing and hearing is that she's going to, she's going to be on that tightrope and the people and these things here where people are, the people are going to not have it. There isn't anything that she's going to be able to say or do to get out of this situation that she finds herself in, that she has placed herself in. Because again, I say there's truth to this. Now, let's pull one more card on this airy Spears. Let's see what we can, what we can get from this person. Let's see what we can get from this person. And I'm seeing that following along to get along, um, going with the flow. This is what I'm hearing about this Aries Spears. Okay. This is just going to give us a little more about Aries Spears. Okay. And it's temperance. And temperance is uh, about balance. They're about patience and balance. And I'm seeing that that is what he is practicing. Okay. I feel like he knows he's going down for this, or he knows that he's, he's going to have issues here. Cause I don't see her going, I don't see her going to prison. I, I just don't, I don't see that. This is very early on in this situation, okay? But she'll be in her own private hell. And when people see her 10 years from now, five years from now, three years from now, they will see her as an abuser of, you know, children. You just don't get out of this. You don't come out of this unscathed, whether you go to prison or you don't. You'll, you'll be in prison irrespective of whether you're physically there. Your mind will be in prison. You will, it's like the, wearing the scarlet letter. That's a good way to describe it. She'll be wearing the scarlet letter for the rest of her life, life, irrespective. Like I said earlier, if it's somebody comes out and says, oh, this is not, this wasn't true. This is this was a joke. See, some people will not, let's just assume that this, all of this is a joke. It's a prank. It's a really bad one. And it isn't, you know, it isn't, but I'm just, just work with me. There will be millions of people that believe it. And even if you brought it out and, they, and Tiffany was, had a stand up and she's like, yeah, that was all a joke to bring in whatever, more people watching me. 
there will be millions of people that don't latch on to that, don't see it, don't hear it, and they'll go to their grave believing it, right? So it's just the power of the word, the power of, you know, but at any rate, um, it's doomsday. It's, 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 it's stick a fork in it. It's done. So I'm going to leave it there. Thank you so much for stopping by the humble seer. Please do consider liking, sharing, subscribing, and leave a comment below and tell me what you think until next time you take good care. Oh, did I say buy me a coffee? If you feel so inclined to do so, the link is in the description box to buy me a coffee. All right. Until next time you take good care. We'll talk again soon. Bye.